I have a boyfriend and he buys me stuff. Yeah, I hit the jackpot, you know. He's not a sugar daddy or anything. Everybody calm down, sit down in the back, okay? <laughs> it's not that serious. He's not that rich, okay? He has less money than a sugar daddy, so I call him my cinnamon papa. He just, <laughs> he takes care of me. We've been together for a while now, so I'm already starting to practice my face when, you know, he proposes. <laughs> I think it's just time to be ready for that, you know? So I've been practicing faces like, oh. Like he just did a magic trick or something. Like, are y'all seeing this? You have to be surprised. You have to be surprised because then they take out a ring and then you have to be like, oh. But I thought about it and I'm like, I don't want a ring. I don't wear rings, you know? If someone's gonna drop a lot of money to show me how much they love me, I'd rather it be on something I need, you know? Like, I just lost a back tooth. <laughs> I'll take an engagement tooth. <laughs> that shit's expensive. As of right now, I will not have a tooth back there for the foreseeable future. So I'll take an engagement tooth. You know, we could take the pictures like this, like. <laughs> We're in love. I would cherish it forever. And then until it fell out again. You know? <laughs> or imagine, guys, imagine if the love of your life goes up to you and is like, I'm in love with you. Will you marry me? I just paid off your student loans. <laughs> oh my God! Oh my God! I've waited my whole life for this. <laughs> I never thought I was gonna pay off that theater degree. <laughs> oh God, I, mean, I love you too, but I don't. God, oh, that would be amazing. That would be amazing. I'm trying to work on my jealousy, you know. He's my first boyfriend, so everything's like new to me. I'm trying to be cool, be a cool girlfriend, you know. <laughs> be cool with everything, you know. He has female friends and I'm all about it, guys. <laughs> no, I love it, it's great. I'm totally cool. He texts them, they text them back. It's, <laughs> it's great, you know. <laughs> I think it's totally appropriate to text your guy friend after 4 p.m., you know? <laughs> That's not an inappropriate time. It's great. So the other day, you know, he's texting with one of his female friends and I go sit right by him and look out the corner of my eye because I'm here for it, you know? <laughs> I'm here for it and the friendship. And I see, you know, it's normal texting and then I see she send him a photo. And it was a photo of an x-ray, her x-ray. I don't know why y'all aren't gasping. <laughs> That's more than naked, okay? <laughs> he hasn't even seen my bones like that. I was like, okay, go with her bones then. Go with her bones. I don't care. And he was trying to calm me down. He's like, boo, boo. She was showing me that she has scoliosis. <laughs> and I was like, okay, well. That does make me feel better. <laughs> because I was gonna make her shit crooked if it weren't already. <laughs> I'm glad she's got scoliosis. <laughs> Texting at 4 p.m. like we're trying to sleep. <laughs>